a PHPC takeover. Here comes PlayStation PHPC. Home hottest. They got the swag. Here comes PHPC. This is a PHPC takeover. A PHPC takeover. PlayStation Home hottest. A PHPC takeover. to PlayStation Home hottest. They got the swag. And welcome to another episode of Big Things on Home. I'm your host, Red Bull Diva. And today our special guest is PHPC. They're some close friends of mine. And we're going to jump right on into this thing and go ahead and ask them a few questions. I'm going to start with Twan. What's up, buddy? I have a question for yeah, you. How you doing? Yeah. I'm good. Um, the first question I want to ask you all tonight is, do you all have a ranking system? Yes, we do have a ranking system, but, um, I'm going to let my lovely Ms. DJ ZZ handle that question for me. Let ladies go first. All right. I will let the ladies go first. Yes, we do have a ranking system. Um, Mr. DJ Chuan is CEO and founder of PHPC. Um, me, myself, I am president. Baby Girl 135 is my secretary. Twilight 1975 is our princess. And D Nasty is our vice president. All right, y'all seem like y'all organized. Then y'all seen all that ordering stuff. Y'all go ahead then. Um, my next question is, what does y'all's fam represent? Yeah, I start off fun. Like my number one rule is always have fun. I mean, like, yo, we come on home to have fun. So remember, my number one rule out to everybody in the crew is always have fun. ZZ rule is love. Like, her number two rule is always love. Like, yo, she want to just show her love to everybody. It don't matter, like, you got a problem, a little problem, a big problem. Like, ZZ always the loving one. Yeah, I agree with Twan. Yeah, as he said before, he says it's all about fun. You know, we come on here and, you know, we get together, we have fun, we have parties. You know, this is a crew, but we really are, we really are fam. Well, all of us are really close together. We talk about our problems and all that. And we just here to enjoy ourselves. And to finish finish that off, it's not just problems that we have on home, but we also do deal with personal problems in real life. So um, we all know that we can come and talk to each other about anything and everything. And then on top of that, party and have lots of fun. So that's why PHPC is about fun and love. Well, that sounds good. It's good to know that you know, you can have somebody to talk to off of the game as well as on the game. And those are two very important things, love and just having fun, because that's what we're here for. I like that answer, you guys. Um, well, my next question is going to be, what type of events do you all have? Yeah, let me start out. Parties. Parties, parties, parties. Hey, let me stop. I mean... PlayStation Home Party Crew, right? Say like, nah. Um, pretty much parties, events. Um, yo, we try to do things different from everybody else. Like, we don't want to be like a copycat. So we try to make sure that we do a lot of different things. Um, reaching, like, we teamed up with GRE. And um, we did the Noob Day. Where we had everybody dress up like noobs. And later on, like, we had a party. That turned out really good. Everybody got the chance to dress like noobs. <laughs> um, D-Nasty. Can you, yo, can you help me out? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, like you said before, we got a new bit. We got a lot of different events planned as for regards for parties, you know what I mean? Uh, we try to throw a little bit of something different in the mix, um, such as such as a 70s party we threw a, about a while ago. We teamed up with GRE. We threw a spotlight party. Um, we try to do a lot of things to, you know, get the word talking. Yeah, I see you, Coco, over there. <laughs> We also teamed up with GRD well, and did date night. That was another um, event that we also do. Um, we try to do that often for couples that are not only together but are married because we find that there is not a lot of things to do on home for couples. We also brought um, speed dating, which was an event that we did just for singles. Um, to get to know people, you know, um, meet different people, and maybe hook up with somebody and, you know, just talk it out and see if they can um, come out of relationship from that. Um, some upcoming events that we do have is like um, Idol 3 is coming, you know, American Idol, well, it's basically coming back. So that's an event that we are basically looking forward to. So just um, different things like that that we are definitely um, looking forward and coming around and making that a regular thing on home. Yo, can I add one more thing? I mean, one more thing that's a good party that we threw a while ago that was a good success was our stoplight party. I mean, our stoplight party was like, I think one of, one of our good parties we threw was everybody who was single, you know, All the single people were green. All the people that was taken were red. And pretty much all the pe people that was confused, you know, like you didn't know if you was dating a woman or dating a man or if you, matter of fact, you just didn't even know you was dating anybody. You just wore yellow. You were just confused. So all my confused people <laughs> was wearing yellow out that day. But, um, yo, it turned out to be a good party, though. You ready if you take it? Exactly. Ready if you take it? No. Yeah. I would also like to add that on Tuesday night, every week we have a shutdown party, which is hosted by PHPC and GRE. We alternate between two clubs, um, Knight's Family, which is my sister Twilight's club, and Sticky Treats, which is Coco Honeybee's club. Um, Pre-party normally starts between 11 and 11.30. And um, the actual party itself starts about 12 a.m. between 12.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Um, we have been doing this for a while now, and it has really become one of the hottest parties on home. Um, we basically party until home kicks you off, and we just really have um, a really good time. I want to really shout out some of the hottest DJs that show up, like DJ Kooji, um, DJ Tawan, of course, myself. Oh, so Wavy has um, been there also, and we have had some really good time. Um, I also want to throw in there that um, we also have recently done some fashion shows, and the most recent fashion show that we have presented was on Valentine's Day, and it was fabulous. Um, it turned out really nice. Um, it was done at Knight's Family Club. The club was designed by um, my sister Twilight. Um, there was a lot of attendance there, and um, it was kind of like a naughty fashion show, real sexy, real hot for Valentine's Day, and, you know, we made it happen, and it was really hot. And um, don't forget, like, we also got the lovely Duchess of DJ, Miss. Lovely ZZ on the ones and twos. Don't forget that part. Okay. It seems like you guys are pretty busy on here. I must admit I have been in a couple of you all's events as well. Um, and I did enjoy myself, so that was fun. Well, moving right along. What type of effect do you all have on the PlayStation Home community? Um, basically, we just offer a safe place for people to have fun Monday through Monday through Saturday. 
you know, it, there's always something going on with us. On a Monday, you can find us doing something. On a Tuesday, you can find us doing something. On a Wednesday, you can find us doing something. Because pretty much when people get on home, they be bored. Like, they be trying to find something to do. Like, what a party at tonight? What event at tonight? Like, what's going on tonight? I mean, me personally, I remember when I first got on home, there was nothing really to do. Like, it was harder trying to find a party. It was hard trying to find an event. But now, like, with us, like, we try to make sure, like, every week, like, every day we doing something. So that way somebody always got somewhere to go. I mean, <laughs> my thing is, you come on home, you come on home to have fun. Like, you don't come on home to be in your personal space, look, like, looking at your walls. Like, who want to be in a Harbor studio looking at their walls? I feel you, Tron. I feel you. I'm looking at a boat that you can't even get on and ride. But, I, yeah, that's, that's what's up. Because when I first got exactly. on home, I was like, what do you do? Yeah. <laughs> I remember I did the glitch and I fell through. I think I landed in the water, but I don't remember. <laughs> yeah, those glitches are something else. Hey, moving right along. Um, I have another question for you guys. Um, what advice would you all give to other fams, like other upcoming fams that are starting on home? The advice that I would, I would give this. if you're starting a fam on home is one, make sure that if you have rules, like stick to them, keep them strong, um, don't fall back on them. And then once you've created that fam, like keep it tight, keep it close. Um, try not to let them fall off, you know. If they do fall off, like ask them questions like what's going on, you know, why don't you come around. Get involved with that person. Let them know that you care because I find that a lot of people leave fams because there's no caring involved like they don't care what goes on in their personal life or even if they have problems on home or they're having you know they getting banned a lot for stupid reasons you know because they don't they don't understand like why do they need to stop fighting or arguing like all that stuff like really it doesn't matter like we're supposed to come over but keep them close to you and make it like a family, not just a group of people that randomly hang out every once in a while. Yo, make it close. Make it a family. Show that love, respect to each other. And, yo, I guarantee, yo, your fam going to get bigger and they going to show you a lot of respect. Exactly. That was nicely put. I mean, one root. Yeah, yo, can I add one more thing to that? Like, another thing, like, we try not to do is, yo, we don't fight. That's one thing we try to do. We, like, we don't argue with nobody. I always tell everybody, just hit the ignore button. If you beef with somebody, hit the ignore button because you can't see what they're saying. Like, one thing about me is I try to tell them, like, yo, if you get banned, it's hard to find you. You got to start a whole new account. I mean, some people like to get banned, but me personally, like, I hate being banned. I don't know about y'all, but I hate giving places at home free money. I know that's right, because if you get banned and you get permanently banned, you have to, like, start over from scratch. I know I would cry. So, it, ZZ, that's great advice for all upcoming fans or even upcoming people just coming on home, the news. That's great advice for them. Um, my last and final question to you all is, what do you all think makes your fam different from other fams on home? D-Nasty, I think that's for you. Go ahead, D-Nasty. <laughs> I believe what makes us different from everybody else is the closeness. You know what I mean? The amount that we all care about each other. You know, almost on a daily basis, I know what's going on with all these people. You know what I mean? And if they haven't heard from me for a couple of days, they will try whatever they can do to contact me to see what's going on with me. And I personally like that, you know, I've been in the fam for about five months now. I knew nothing about home or anything like that. And Twan and ZZ introduced me to the fam with open arms. And I never felt 
um, more welcome. All right. That sounds good enough. Well, you all seem like the family then. Y'all have love, y'all are caring, y'all opening y'all arms to people, y'all throw parties, y'all have home idols. I mean, y'all just doing it big on home. So, everyone in the YouTube world, this has been another wonderful episode of Big Things on Home with the PHPC Party Crew. I'd like to thank each and every one of you all for coming. And I hope you all enjoyed the show. If you all are looking for a loving, caring, party filled fam to join, go right ahead and join PHPC. I'm the girl Red Bull Diva, and we out. A PHPC takeover. PlayStation Home, how to stay PlayStation Home, hottest. They got the swag.